guys, Nikki from Broadcast Beat Magazine here with Alex Clive, founder and CEO of 360 Designs. How's it going? Good, thanks. Good. Yeah. Are you enjoying the show? I'm loving it. How about you? Excellent. It's very good. Good. A lot of foot traffic over here? It's been, uh, it's been great, actually. We've had so many people coming by the booth, people that we thought we'd have to go out and see, but everyone's coming here, which is great, obviously. Well, good. Congratulations. Now, Alex, tell us a little bit about 360 Designs. So uh, the company is a year old. Uh, I'm a former camera operator. I was I was involved in the first kind of incarnation of VR, and a couple of years ago I went out looking for a professional virtual reality camera, professional 360 cameras, and wasn't really happy with what was out there. So I decided to make one, and um, the Blackmagic micro cameras, which all our rigs are based around, came out a year ago, and I was there when they announced them, and it just ticks all the boxes for me for the camera I've been looking for. You know, to build these rigs. Good. So yeah. So tell me about the rigs. Tell me about what you're showing at Cinegear this year. So we've got uh, this is our Mini i3 here, and this is uh, a camera primarily designed for live 360. So we do a lot of live 360 stuff. We did the Oscars and live 360. Uh, these cameras are at Coachella and uh, South by Southwest. So this is a really good camera for live using the micro studios because you've got SDI out. You've got all locking connections. Super reliable cameras. They've got internal cooling, which is a lot of the problem with the other cameras that people are building VR rigs around. So, uh, and then this runs in, this is a live stitch right here. Uh, that's the Mini i3. And then we have our Mini i4 here, which uh, is more for VOD, anything non-live. You get lots of overlap with this. Uh, so it's much better for post, for stitching. All right, cool. And both of them are available for shipping or? <laughs> uh, we've actually just sold out, <laughs> uh, well, but I mean, in theory, problem. yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's no, good problems out. But uh, no, we're, we're looking now at July. Uh, for shipping the next the next production batch. And what's the price point we're looking at? Uh, this starts at eleven. Well, this is eleven thousand. Okay. Um, this is a couple of different options, but around eleven thousand, and this one is around fourteen thousand dollars for everything. Though that's the lenses, the control gear, the uh, J boxes that power it, provide the Gen Lock, oh, the lenses, everything. Cool. Well, thank you so much for speaking with us, Alex. Uh, website we can see it. Uh, three sixty designs io, or you can just search for three sixty designs. Thank you so much. Now I'm obsessed with VR, so I'd like to play with that if that's okay with you. Absolutely. Right. Go. Be my guest. This is Nikki with Broadcast V.